In the Cohen Tetrapod collection, we find our first example of intersexual selection. I want to direct your attention to the large black bird with the very striking red throat pouch within this bird exhibit. This is the great frigate bird. Frigate birds are found within the order Pelicaniformes, meaning they are related to pelicans. They are a large water bird over one meter in length and have a very large wingspan of over two meters. There are five different species of frigate bird within this family. All species of frigate bird are in fact very adept flyers. They often spend the majority of their life airborne, usually only landing on rocky cliffs to breed or rest. Frigate birds are found throughout islands in the Pacific and often come up to the southern reaches of Florida to breed. It is within this breeding season that the male frigate birds use their large red inflatable pouches. In this specimen, we see that the red throat patch, which is a membranous structure, has been inflated artificially as it would appear during breeding season. They inflate this red membranous pouch in order to attract female attention. Females are choosy within this species, as is common within many birds. The female chooses the showiest or most attractive male based on his red throat pouch. This attractive showy male then has the opportunity to mate and pass on his genes to the next generation. It is this reason, the sexual dimorphism developing in order for female choice, that makes the frigate bird an excellent case of inter, also known as between gender selection. An interesting side note not quite related to intersexual selection is that males have sometimes been known to fight while their throat patches are inflated. And they will often try to deflate the throat patch of another male by pecking at it to cause it a hole where it will rupture. This can often lead to infection and in some rare cases, death. Sadly, the BD Biodiversity Museum does not have a female frigate bird on display. However, let me tell you about the coloration of a female frigate bird. The majority of the feathers will share that brown black color that the male exhibits, but she will not have a bright red throat pouch. One of the main differentiations between males and females is that she will have a, often a white coloring on her underbelly. In general, she is much more dull colored than the male frigate bird. The reason for this is, is that females rear the young. And in order to decrease chances of predation of themselves as well as their young as they're being raised, they like to camouflage within the environment. And the dull coloring of their feathers and the lack of any very bright red inflatable me membranes helps them camouflage and protect both themselves and the young.